Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, I would be explaining you how to solve a transportation problem using the least cost method. So before starting with the video, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe my channel by pressing the subscribe button below. Also, if you find this video helpful, please like the video and share the video. Also, if you have any doubt regarding this video or if you want to have uh, any other problem solved or you have any suggestion, please mention in the comment section below. Also check out my other videos, all the links are given in the description. Also don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Google+. Now starting with the problem. So this was the matrix, transportation matrix and we have to solve by using the least cost method. So the matrix was 4, 8, 8, 12, 8, 11, 10, 6, 9. And here supply was 50, 150, 300, here demand was 150, 100 and 250. So first you have to check whether it is a balanced problem or not. So you have to add total supply and total demand. Since the total supply is equal to 500 and total demand is equal to 500. So it is a balanced problem. Now how to proceed? First you have to find the least of all the squares. You check the values given in the blocks or squares. So least value is 4 of 4, 8, 8, 12, 8, 11, 10, 6, 9, the least is 4. So first you have to allocate here. So here demand, here supply was 50, but demand was 150. So maximum 150 can be supplied. So you write 50 here, you put 0 here. So you cross that column. This column you get crossed. This is the first step. And demand now remains 100. From 150 it comes out to 100. Now again you check the remaining blocks are 8, 8, 8, 11, 6 and 9. So the least is 6. So see here supply is 150, demand is 250. So maximum 150 can be supplied. So you write 150 here, you put 0 here, you cross this column. And here now demand remains 100 since 150 has been fulfilled. Now what values are left? 8, 11 and 9. So the minimum is 8. So here supply is 300 but demand is only 100 from the first step so you write 100 here you put 0 here you cross this row like this and here supply remains 200 now two blocks remain 11 and 9 so minimum is 9 so you first allocate here so here 100 was left from the previous step all right now you put 100 here you put 0 here you cross this row and here supply remains 100. Now only one block is left in the last step that is this 11. So you write 100 here. 100 is demanded and 100 is need to be supplied. So 0, 0 and you cross this. So all the cells. So these cells are allocated 4, 11, 8, 6 and 9. And number of allocation is M plus N minus 1 number of rows plus number of columns minus 1 so 3 plus 3 minus 1 is equal to 5 so since the allocation are 5 1 2 3 4 and 5 so this we have obtained the basic feasible solution so the minimum cost or the transportation cost incurred will be 4 into 50 plus 8 into 100 plus 11 into 100 plus 6 into 150 plus 9 into 100 that is 4 into 50 plus 8 into 100 plus 11 into 100 plus 6 into 150 plus 9 into 100. So you add, the answer comes out to be 3900 rupees. Alright. So this was the video regarding transportation problem solution using least cost method. You check out the link. Uh, in the link you will find how to solve the transportation problem using Vogel's approximation method and northwest corner method also check out my other videos and if you have found this video helpful please like the video share the video comment if you have any doubt and subscribe my channel if you have not already subscribed take care bye bye thank you I go 
Whatever I say, I'll remember your 